Hello. <laughs> hello, 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 hello. How are you guys? I hope you all are having a very, very beautiful evening and doing what you want to do, having fun, enjoying yourself, being good, being bad in a good way. <laughs> However it is you want to do it. But I hope that you are doing it well. As for me, you hear my fan going? Yes, it's going on me. I'm comfortable. I feel relaxed. Just came in the house and taking care of some things. And I wanted to get this little video out. You know, it's been a while since I've had my Throwback Thursday or my Theater Thursday. So today, we are going to have Theater Thursday. We're going to see what's good out there, what's good out there, what I've seen already, what's my favorite old school movie, and what movie I want to see today. So, <laughs> uh, if you want to know how everything is going with me, you guys, I feel alright. I really do. Um, I'm not in the mood to go try on all them damn clothes on my other channel. So, for, the old, for you guys that watch me on Gorgeous Grateful Granny, I did put up a small haul. I bought three amazing little shirts. And honey, I love them. It's like a transition from the summer to the fall type stuff. And I'm loving it. And I hope y'all go check me out over there. It's not a long video. It's nice. Um, I, I should have had them with outfits and little outfits and boots or something in the first but I wasn't in the mood for all of that you guys and then coming over here and trying to talk to my babies over here so I love you all <laughs> but I have to save my energy for trying to do both so I did that one already it should be up in about 8 minutes I didn't uploaded it it's uploading as we speak. I am doing over here, doing my thing. Uh, I hope everybody is enjoying the dating scene. Or I hope you guys that are married are enjoying each other and doing the dating thing. Um, I feel just because you're married, which I used to be, you don't forget to date. Don't forget to make time for each other. Don't forget to love and pamper and go all out for each other all the time. Never take each other for granted, ever. And that was one of the things that I wanted to talk about today, too. But I'll talk about that later. But for right now, I want to tell everybody, get your asses up and do what it is that you have to do to make yourself happy. I'm looking all shiny and a little glitter today. This is on purpose today. I didn't do anything with the glitter. I got this little uh, Bath and Body Works spray. And honey, it smells so good. And it's beautiful. I got uh -uh, my lip gloss out on my teeth. But I got that in. I smell good. My skin is so nourished. I uh still using my L'Oreal on my face and I got some uh sexy. It's called E It's so sexy. Eagle so so whatever the hell the heck it is, it's sexy. And it comes from uh Victoria's Secrets and it smells wonderful. And I like to put on extra, so I got on like a little spray, and it makes your skin feel so marvelous. And plus, you know, I'm an oil lady. I love to oil down. I do this. This is my little treatment that I do every night for myself is that I oil my skin down. I don't care how hot it is, honey. <laughs> I like my skin to feel nourished and fresh. And with the little oils and some smell goods. And honey, you'll be feeling like number one. Yes, you do. You have to take the time to care about yourself. You know, you already have issues. So, 
Why not feel fabulous even when you go to bed? You can just feel marvelous. <laughs> I hope y'all know what it is. But anyway, my movie that I've just recently saw was Skull Island. And it got Brie Larson, John Goodwin, and John uh, Carell, and Samuel Jackson. It's okay. I like the action. Um, I like the action. It's alright. It wasn't what I thought it was going to be. I thought it was going to be longer. More, uh, more action. Him fighting more things. And, um, the people standing for him. I don't want to give the plot away. Um, it just could have been more better for me. It, it it didn't do what I expected it to do. Y'all know that the first come came home when he came out. Oh my God! They took you through the islands. They 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 did the whole nine yards with 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 the people with all the people surrounding like like some different like different nations or whatever it was a different culture that's the name of it. a different culture it was scary it was exciting it was it was off the chain and then they got this huge humongous gate you know what I mean and you like oh my god what 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 what's this about no <laughs> I just didn't get the feel for this one. So if you ask me with my little five stars, I'll give it a two and a half. It wasn't all that to me. I thought it would have been better. Samuel L. Jackson is Samuel L. Jackson all the time. Uh, John Carell, <laughs> he, he a fool <laughs> on here. John Goodman, he, he's serious, you know. You guys got to... I said, if you're going to check it out, you got to form your own opinion about it. But to me, it wasn't worth going to see. Or if you're going to rent it, I will wait. I will wait. Let just wait. If you're going to spend $9.99 or whatever, I spend the $9.99 and just get the movie. Or just wait till it come on Netflix. <laughs> it wasn't all that. I just, I just didn't, I just didn't like it. It didn't have enough excitement. It ended too fast for me, and it was blah, 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 blah. Uh, and that was Skull Island. Uh, I give it a two and a half stars. I did not really care for it that much. It was okay, and it wasn't all of that. I wish it was because. I was really excited about it, and it wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't nothing. Sorry. No, I'm not. <laughs> it wasn't that. It wasn't exciting. It it had a little bit of action. It has. It had a lot of action in it, but it wasn't like I expected it to be. Like the first two Kong movies, the old Kong, the new Kong, and the other Kong. They just wasn't all that. Was his ass big? He was humongous. But you got to watch it. You got to watch it. Uh, you got to form your own opinion. Some people like things and some people don't. Uh, my next movie from back in the day. I got to break your in on. Oh, you did a good job. You take it down the table. Thank you. Close the eye. And then there were two. told you. Go c close the door. Close, say hello and close. No. Alright, goodbye. Thank you. Hello, bye. <laughs> Don't slam the door. Don't slam the door. And he slams the door. But anyway, my next movie from back in the day and it's still my all-time favorite. When I am ailing, as they say, or hurting my body. When my body hurts, I need me some laughs and a little song in my life. Honey, it's the it's all.
the Wizard of Oz, Oz with Michael Jackson, Diana Ross, Nipsey Russell, Lena Horn, and so, so, so Isaac Hayes, honey, as that lion, he was fake. <laughs> I loved everything about that movie. I loved it when I was young, and I still loved it. I love it. My children grew up on that movie, right? Huh? Didn't I tell you you're going to get the juice when you get through eating? Yeah. Now go and, and do not slam the door. If you do, you're not getting nothing. But my children, my daughters, my daughter Lizetta was so scared of that lion. It was crazy. Honey, my part was when the flying monkeys came. And she said, ew, ew, not the flying monkeys. Yes, the flying monkeys. Y'all, I love that movie. The, it, the, the, the songs, the, the parts. Um, she getting lost as old as she was. And in um, old as she was. And she get lost and all these kids come out the walls. You have freed us from that. <laughs> and they start breaking all out the walls and they coming out. You have freed us. Thank you. Oh, wonderful guy. Thank you. I'm like, oh, look at here. And when they get to easing down their roads, girl, hey, listen. And when the scarecrows. He says, fellas, it's today, the day that I'm going to get down off of this hill pole? No, you are not going to get down off of this hill pole. And what is the pole anthem again? I was like, oh my God, do I have to sing that song again? Now that's how much I watch that movie. Yes, that's how much. <laughs> I love that movie. It's a good movie for the kids to watch. It's exciting. I even like watching the regular Wizard of Oz. I like watching uh, with uh, do you think it's Judy Garland? I like watching that one and with the little bitty um, the elves, not the elves, but the little people, and they come out and they sing that little song. <laughs> I like watching that song. I, and I like it when, um, when the, um, the Wicked Witch pulls down these little things and she falls down in all them beds of roses. That was so beautiful. The scenery was amazing on, on the, uh, the regular Wizard of Oz and the Emerald City. <laughs> but when you got to the Wiz, oh, honey, let me tell you. When they sprinkle that down and that lion say, I am feeling good. <laughs> and he got that hair going around. <laughs> Come with me, Dorothy, and I'll take you to the other side. I was like, oh. And Michael Jackson was like, oh my God, this is a trap. <laughs> yeah, them are one of the best movies Ever. I'm telling you, when you think you didn't see some, you ain't seen nothing until you see that baby. You ain't seen nothing, not a doggone thing, not a doggone thing. I'm telling you, I was so excited. Even today, being grown and have children and grandchildren, I am still excited about that movie. And I watch it as much as I possibly can. Sometimes on the holidays, it get ready to come out, and I'll be so excited. But um, I actually has it, have it. I found it one night on uh, Netflix. And honey, when I'm in that little I don't feel good state, and I'm I'm just like can't move, can't do nothing, don't feel like this, don't feel like that. 
let me tell you. I go in there and I get me some popcorn. And I get I love that kettle corn with that. Like that kettle corn. And I will turn on that movie, get me something cold to drink, wrap myself up in some cover. Or if it's hot, take me the best shower. Be cool, honey. Relaxed. And you can't tell me nothing. You can't tell me nothing. And and the kids, everybody little by little, ease on in there with me. They be like, Mama, you are you watching the whiz? I was like, mm-hmm. The kids coming in, they be like, oh, Granny, <gasps> did you see the lion? I was like, yes, I did. Yes, I did. <laughs> so that is one movie, and that's The Wiz. I'm taking you to see The Wizard. That's the old back in the day Wiz with Michael Jackson and Diana Ross. The next movie, you guys, look here. If I had a way, if I had a way to get all of y'all and we get together and we go see Girl Trip, <laughs> all of us looking cute, dressed up, hair done, makeup done, Clothes on, honey, smelling like a million bucks. Baby, we would be on a night on a town. We would have a ball. And this is how it is on Girls' Night with Queen Latifah and Jada Pinkin. And they are out. And I think it's like a, a, a bachelorette party or a bachelor. Yeah, I have got to see that movie. I seen the previews of it. I don't want to wait till it come on TV. I seen the previews of it. And it's so much fun. I know y'all seen the previews of it. And I and I said it's just the preview. Y'all, the preview that I saw is when they in there and they drinking and um she like, no, no, no. I'm not gonna take another drink. You know how I drink, do me. She's like, just take the drink. Just take the drink. <laughs> and they in New Orleans, right? And they take the drink. And as she is taking the drink, they was like, come on, come on. We're going to all take our turn and get on this thing where they fly across the little the little crowd or whatever the case may be. Oh, y'all. Ain't no way in here y'all would have got me to do it. I'm so sorry. I would have cheated y'all on, though. But she got on there, and she was so drunk. She peed on everybody. Y'all, we have got to go see that movie. Now, who would that be? Is that E Gallery that would be that that way? Miss Sharon, I can't, Sharon, just, I can't even say the name. <laughs> Tiffany, a prone, a prone, a prone. Would that be you? <laughs> e Gallery, not E Gallery. Y'all know. Y'all know it's. <laughs> I got so many. Hold on. It's Tiffany. All right, friend. I'm trying to think of her. Uh, Dominique Leah. Um, e Gallery. Y'all, it's on the tip of my damn tongue. Noel. Um. It's so many of you I would hang out with. It would be ridiculous. All of my subscribers. Cami28. Man. Can y'all see us all out there? Can y'all see us? And I cannot think of my girl name. Hold on. Hold on. I ain't, I ain't seen her. I talked to her in so long. I'm looking. I have got to find her name. Because she was the first one. Hold on, it's coming to me. It's coming to me. <laughs> I don't know. But that's my girl. I'm trying to not think right now. <laughs> Sandra Hall. Uh, it's so many of you. And we would all just be. And you know who I'm talking about. Um. 
She always make the live videos with her husband and her, and they are so sweet together. That's my baby right there. And she just contacted me the other day and said hello. I cannot think. I am so, I got so much on my mind right now. But, you have to leave your husband at home. <laughs> and it would just be the ladies night, honey. We would clown so bad. Wherever we were, they would put us out. Because, honey, I would not stop laughing from the beginning to the end. And we would just show out. You, you hear me? We will show out. We have got to go see this movie and we have got to get together on chat and we have got to talk about it. Do y'all understand me? And this is called Girls Night. And it's with Queen Latifah and Jaina Pickett and some more beautiful ladies that I cannot remember as well. I hope y'all enjoyed Theater Thursday. It went like it seemed like it went so fast, my babies, but it did not. <laughs> I love you guys so very much, and I hope that y'all enjoy Theater Thursday. Come on out and see what we can see Theater Thursday when we talk about the movies that's good or bad. Theater Thursday. Talk about good movies in the future. Good movies in the past. Good movies that you want to see when you're sitting on your ass. Hey, good movies. Theater Thursday. Good movies. Theater Thursday. Okay. This is Mama Roxy Sex. And I'm here for your wallet, your purses, and your pocketbooks, baby. Your hearts and your minds. Do not, you understand me? Forget next Thursday is Throwback Thursday. We can talk about anything from the past. From your clothes you used to wear on your ass. From the movies that you used to see. From the songs that you can remember. And from the hairstyles that you used to rock back in. So, I, hey, I'm here with you. This is throw that'll be this is theater Thursday. Next Thursday is throwback Thursday. So send me those emails. Foxy Roxy68 at gmail.com. And if you can't hit me there, just leave me something down below. Right, right up on the right up on the right up on the the thing. You know what I'm talking about. Who is that peeking? Get out. <laughs> I love y'all, and I hope that you all enjoy the three movies on Fifth Thursday. Now listen, go take y'all a bath, sit back, relax, and enjoy yourselves. And I would like to let you know that um, Skull Island is on Voodoo, and I think it's $4.99 to rent. And nine ninety nine. I think it's nine ninety nine to buy y'all. I'm not for sure, but I do know that. I think if you look, they might have uh, the Wiz on Netflix. But I saved it on my Netflix in my little list. That's what I did. So, anyways, I hope that y'all all had a beautiful day. And this movie, I think, is out in the theaters right now. I hope y'all enjoy yourselves. Ciao. Saranara. Sanuk. Chica. Whatever. <laughs> I hope y'all have a beautiful day. God bless. All right. Ciao. Mommy loves y'all.